That boy Jesse was hitting one of them. Well, no, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. <laughs> he's about to get his. He's about to get split in half, bro. <laughs> we appreciate y'all, man. If you enjoyed the reaction, make sure you like the video, comment down below, let us know your thoughts, and subscribe on the bell icon so you're notified. Know <laughs> no cap with, with the smoke. On the yeah. <laughs> What's good? It's your boy Sheen. What's up, bird? And we are jumping back into Breaking Bad, finishing off season three today. Last episode, that boy Walt. I don't know who that man think he is, but room, room, me. just no cause some big problems, man. I don't know how they're gonna get out of this. It was Jesse. If Jesse would never went there, he would never did that. I know, but I'm just saying. I don't know how they're gonna clean this up and then be able to cover their asses after this one so it's gonna be a lot to go down in this finale can't wait let's get straight into it man make sure y'all click that link in the description and head over to our patreon because we're gonna be a season ahead basically man finishing up season four on the patreon by this time well by the time y'all get this so make sure y'all hit that link head over there and sub up because y'all are truly missing out man and without further ado let's finish up season three of breaking bad let's get it Hey Jesse old crib. That's Walt's crib. Yeah. Boy had to move. <laughs> Boy ran a mover and got missing. What's going on right now? That's not Walt's old crib. Hey, I hope we're not too late. No, no, perfect okay. timing. Good to meet you all. What the? Nice to meet you. That is their crib before they bought it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's young Walt. I'm That's before my man's was here. Oh, All right. Whoa. Honestly, what I Blaine do tree. is bored. So this is it, honey. What do you say? Do you want to take a tour? Sure. Young and smooth. How the fuck they get my man to look like that? <laughs> it's a nice big living room. Mm -hmm. And, and um, this is the dining area. Yeah, and this just shows how far left shit has went since then. How many bedrooms? Three. Told you. They're all pretty good size, and uh, oh, the, this is the first one here. Who got the leather jacket on? Fuck, is he a biker? Biker boy? I think we're gonna need at least five, don't you think? Five? Yeah. Do I look like I'm about to drop a litter? No, 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 no. Ooh. I'll have three kids total eventually. No, but we'll need a spare room for a study so that I could work at home and you can write. Right? Work at home. Shit. Okay, um, what about a wine cellar? I mean, we certainly cannot be expected to live without a wine cellar. Very funny. Mm. For our price range, this is as good as it gets. Well, then let's stretch our price now. range. Now? Did you win the lottery and not tell me? He did. Why be cautious? We've got nowhere to go but up. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Started from the bottom, now the whole fucking game here. My boy Walt, killer now. He did that drama, no hesitation. Man, I'm running somebody over for my man's for no hesitation, but keep forgetting. He can't take that car back home. Yeah. They're gonna have to get a whole new car that's just like his. Same license plate. I know he's scared. I'd be shook. First time? Yeah, but now he. I feel like he just flew through. Uh, what about the killing now? That's just scary. Walter, you see us? Yeah, I see you. I'd like you to exit your vehicle and start walking toward us. I'm gonna need some some kind of assurance. <laughs> I assure you, I could kill you from way over here if it makes you feel any better. But the sniper in the back, more than me. I can't prepare to do anything. Got the old head. He put the hat on again. Uh, that's Heisen. where he get in the character. Heisen. Oh, got his hands dirty. That man might be chilling. You want to put your arms out to the sides for me, if you would? Yeah, if you killed them, you don't know. Like, Gus got to take precaution, boy. You know, I haven't slept since Thursday. I was out all night cleaning up after you. You said no half measures. Funny how words can be so open to interpretation. You're gonna wanna get your car fixed. Let's see how this goes first. No cat. <laughs> might not need to get my car fixed. You might throw me in the trunk. Gotta watch him. Yeah, he don't got no soul in him. 
Your medical condition, has it grown worse? Not that I know of, no. Is there a ringing in your ears? Are you seeing bright lights or hearing voices? I'm quite well, thank you. No. Clearly you are not. No rational person would do as you have done. Explain yourself. My partner was about to get himself shot. I intervened. Some worthless junkie. For him, you intervene and put us all at risk. Some contemptible junkie who couldn't keep the peace for eight hours. He was angry because those two dealers of yours had just murdered an 11 year old boy. I heard about it. He should have let me take care of them. That's what I'm saying. Again, maybe he thought it was you who gave the order. Are you asking me if I ordered the murder of a child? I would never ask you that. Where is Pinkman now? I can't tell you that. A couple of time zones away, at least. He has enough money to last forever. He knows he needs to keep moving. You'll never find him. It's what I do, after all. Send that boy Mike after him, it's over. I saved his life, I owed him that. But now, he and I are done. Which is exactly what you wanted, isn't it? Option A, you kill me right here and now. You can kill me, no witnesses. Then, the next few weeks or months, tracking down Jesse Pinkman and you kill him too. What is option B? I continue cooking. You and I both forget about Pinkman. We consider this a lone hiccup. The boy Mike, like he's he on this shit right now. You'd need a new assistant. Gail. I could get right on that. No. This time I choose. Bring that boy Gail back. Yeah. You got to. Run this shit clean. Do this shit right this time. Your car. Get it fixed. Yeah. Well, I'd have walked backwards. Make <laughs> sure they ain't even no gun at me. He got his car fixed. Yeah. That's a new, no, that's the same car. It's like a new car. That's Gail's car, I think. You got new keys. Really? Because Jesse might have a key. Yeah, they gotta be. Ah! <laughs> In a <Good> suit. <laughs> it's good to be back. By all means, Gail. Let's cook. Gail might be mad because he about what's going to happen is he's going to set that temperature to the temperature that he told him was wrong. He's like, yo, he just lied to get me out of here. Room, room, room. You're silly, Pop-Pop. Well, mm -hmm. little. That's not a nose, that's a horn. Is that so? His real nose is little. Huh. I learned all kinds of things being with you. You can see he a, really, he a family man now. Give me a hug. Oh, I see your mama. Don't keep her waiting. Bye, Pop Pop. Bye, baby. He got them gloves on. I know. He got the Mike Jackson. He about to put these balloons to something and had that joint fly up in the air, boy. About to pop, turn the electricity off. Oh, he's different. Whose place is this? He's different. This must be a lot of money. What is this? You got that silence of James Bond shit. Damn! One bullet. What's going he on? He a grandpa. He pop pop during the day, assassin during the night. And he used to be a cop, so he know all the stuff to clean. Check your corners, yeah. all that. Yeah. I'm gonna hit the collateral it's damage. A dangerous shot man. Though. You a damn fool. What was the NPC? Why you Why not? Like, <laughs> shoot, bro, he shoot, he was shooting at the wall. <laughs> like, what a goopy is literally shit. nothing in front of me. Boy looked at him. Shoot through the wall. Oh, he's crazy. He helped him. Chow, you have anything you want to tell me? Thank God you're here. They, they keep me prisoner. Mandem said. They steal my chemicals. I, I can't stop them. I am businessman. You're a businessman. Ask her if she's still there. Peng, the high jai ma. She says yes. He said a lot more than yes. Drive it. She good behind the wheel. 
Good. She's good driver. Good. <laughs> Gotta look like. So have her drive you to the hospital. <laughs> We're shining right in the hand. That shit hurt, boy. No cap, though. I'd be crying like that. And that shit's unexpected. Where'd they cross? Laredo looks like. They didn't exactly send their A players. But like you said, it's cartel, all right. Damn. What about Pinkman? I'm making inquiries. Bro, he know Walt not gonna let him kill Pink. Yeah. But he gotta pay though. I gotta chop your finger off or something. Okay. You can take your mask off now. Well, why, Sunny? Does that guy ever leave? When exactly did that start? That's yeah, new. I had a little drama with the person you replaced. You're looking for that boy, though. If you're at all worried about working with me. No, I'm not. Because whatever my shortcomings last time, I intend for things to go perfectly from here on out. Yes. Scale, you're great. You said that last time. Like things to be done is exactly how we're going to do them, period, from here on out. So please teach me. I don't like that. They teach me? Yeah. Yeah, that boy eavesdropping. But uh, that boy Gail replaced that man. That's what I keep saying. That's the vibe I'm getting. That boy, all them books in there he got. Boy, genius. Boy, a simple man. Books, plants, and no TV music. You think the cartel sent people to get him? Something about to happen to him. This cartel. He about to splat this man. Wow. This is. A... I should have called first. Uh, I'm not interrupting anything, am I? I? I'm sorry for the inconvenience. Oh, no, no. It's no inconvenience. I'm in the crib chilling, mate. I need to talk to you about something. Something rather pressing. How soon you might be able to take over the lab yourself. I know it. You Told and you. Uh, an assistant. I would push come to shove. Has Walter ever talked to you about why he got into this particular line of work? He did too much. Has he ever spoken to you about his health problems? Oh, shit. They kill him. They just say he died, died from cancer. From cancer. What exactly are his health problems? He's dying of cancer. It is why he does this, to provide for his family, which he's accomplished. They will never want for anything. He's seen to that. Don't know that he's fully accepted the reality of it. And well, not to sound cold-blooded, but I am running a business here. A very large investment in this. There's so much overhead that I can't afford to shut down, not even for a week. So you understand my concern intend to keep Walter on as long as he wants. But as he cannot or will not tell me how long that might be, I must prepare. Uh, that's facts though. You got like mm -hmm. more next man up type shit. I, I suppose if we had at least a few more cooks together, you don't think you're ready now? He is such a, a master. There's always more for me to learn. I'm thinking that if we had one or two more cooks. One more? One more, I guess we'll do it, I suppose. I believe in you, Gail. I know that when the time comes, you will be ready. Oh, got oh. that look, bro. Like, Mandem is mad devious. He gonna let Walt know that. Devious. What's up? Cause I feel like Gail really appreciate what he does with the meth shit. Is there, um, you can't even talk, cause Mandem Any here. Any particular trick to purging the catalyst bed? No, it's pretty straightforward. I'll show you when we get there. But you back back fucking Randy Orton. You about to make a mad noise? Uh, I thought he was gonna try to see. Yeah, cause they say, yeah, what? 
Hold on, buddy. This guy is all. That's Mike. Yeah. Can't you see I'm in conference? I'm looking to find a client of yours. I was hoping you could help me out with an address. Jesse Pinkman. Jesse Pinkman in the phone book, Jesse Pinkman. Hmm. How would one track him down, I wonder? Jesse Pinkman, current whereabouts. What am I, eighth grade hall monitor? <laughs> current whereabouts? <laughs> Let me tell you Whoa. something, Mikey. You are good right there. Stop playing with that man, Mike. That boy is Press about step on your his head, business. Man. You pretending otherwise only wastes my time and serves to annoy me. There are rules to this uh, lawyer thing. Attorney-client privilege. I mean, that, that's a big one. Uh, that's something I provide for you. Old Saul gives him up pretty easy. What's to keep him from giving me up? You see? So then where's the trust? That's true. I trust the hole in the desert I'd leave you in. Don't make me beat you till your legs don't work. Now tell <laughs> me where to find him. You know it's the right thing. I, I can't tell you, Mike. I just, I couldn't live with myself. I'm sorry. You ain't about to live at all. But who should say I didn't write the address down in, in my day planner? Scratch piece of paper <laughs> somewhere. <laughs> Who's to say I didn't write down a location strictly for my own professional use? Do not touch anything on my desk. I'm gonna leave the room, uh, make myself a Nescafe. I wasn't here when you took this shit. Yeah. Boy, Virginia? That's not Virginia. VA? VA is Virginia. I'm just looking out for you, that's all. Like a mother hen. Believe me, money laundering ain't what it used to be. Wasting your time. I'm buying the car wash. End of story. Well, one look at this place, you're gonna fall in love. Go ahead and buy that car wash and that have it? that bull asking mad questions. Where else are you going to find a cash-only business that's this much fun? Unless we're talking massage parlors and... Uh... He's still Gosh, on this man. laser tag shit. Yeah, this... The laser tag shit is kind of stupid, though. Nobody laser tag. This is years ago, but... <laughs> Who's that car? Yo, Paul is monitoring every move Walt made. Snack bar's over there. Nothing stopping you from selling that's a nice beer to ass the parents. Spot. That's... Holy Christ. We're good? This constitutes good where you're from? You, my car is bugged? What have you gotten me into? You're my very own PI threatening to break my leg. Service-wise, this is over and above. Cause you know that boy Mike, he know how to bug everything. Seriously rethinking my pricing, yeah. And that goes double for you, hip hop. Wow. I give us maybe 24 hours before he figures out that address uh -huh. goes nowhere. You guys do your thing, you make it snap. And the boy's following them. He might walk in. Be like, yo, get your ass And then Saul's here, ass is done, too. How are you holding up? Mm. I got my old job back. At least until they kill me and Gale takes over. So he's their boy, huh? He's their boy. He asks a lot of questions about the cooking process. I try to be as vague as possible, but I got that guy Victor watching me, listening to every word I say. Only thing saving me is... Gail's fastidiousness. Once he feels confident that he knows my entire method. You gotta move Skylar and them away. They're not gonna do nothing with them. They're just gonna kill Walt. You know what we do. This nigga crazy. Does he mean kill Gus? There's got to be some other way. Same shit they did with Too Close. Better for you to just go to the cops. All right. All right. I mean, I can't believe I'm saying that at all, but. Tell Hank. All the shit you could tell him, federal witness protection, that's a good deal. That's for me, I'll, I'll hit the road, yo, I mean, I'll make it. What do you want, bro? You'll last a week. We had a good run, but it's over. Yeah, that we had a good run hurt. Yeah, cause that's like really Never like, it's the end of the world. The cook can't stop. Production cannot stop. Gus can afford to. So if I'm the only chemist that he's got, and I've got leverage. It's gonna kill Gail. If I'm the only chemist that he's got. That's fucked up, bro. You got him fired and then you want to kill him? That's facts though. I can't do it, Mr. White. You call him Mr. White. I'm not a... I'll do it. Give them that resin. I'm gonna need your help. I mean, they're watching me day and night. 
and never leave me alone with Gail, not for a moment. He's not in the phone book. I can't find him on the internet. I can't do it in the lab. Victor's always there. You hear this guy? What? Shake Victor for even an hour one night. I think then that I may be able to make it look like an accident. There's got to be some Bro, way. he's willing to kill for anything now. Yeah. But when it comes down to you and me versus him, I'm truly sorry, but it's going to be him. Or the only edge that I've got, as long as they don't know that you're in town. But I, I need you to track him. Oh, Victor, about the walk his now. address, and I'll do the rest. Look, I, I, I saved your life, Jesse. Damn, he trying to put that over his head. Are you gonna save mine? Oh, that's facts, though. Cause I gotta let your ask it. Hang, hang, hang. Can let you ask it. Hang, 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 hang. Nah, he gotta get them out of there. Especially if he about to go do this, you don't know what Gus is gonna do. Yeah, I'm gonna make it look like an accident. Like, bro, like, it don't matter if you make it look like an accident. It's just logic, bro. Like, I know Walt is intelligent and he knows most likely what's coming. That's why he wanted Gal out of there in the first place. Chad. And now all of a sudden. It's us or them. And all of a sudden now Gal is dead. It's us or him. You gonna just kill Walt? How about that one? Like he said, that shit can't wait a week. He has somebody too much overhead. He has somebody cooking before Walt. It don't matter, that shit's on the street. 6353 Juan Tabo Boulevard, apartment 6. 6353 Juan Tabo Yo, High's in a different being. At this point, like, he, this, this murder has, like. He's home? He can't really put, yeah. like, a motive behind it other than. watching the place. He just want to stay alive. Other the other things, it was the operation was kind of Dude's breaking tired, down, bro. Wow. That's the only reason. It's me or him. You bugging? I got a kid. I got family. Boy, Gail don't got nobody, bro. Don't do this, Mr. White. It's the only way, bro. Please go to the cops. Don't go to the cops. We all book. Like, come on, dummy. Everybody got to go down. Like, I go to the cops. I'm going down. Like, do it. <laughs> But in his protection, he might be able to get out of it. But then they know that he was doing this shit the whole time, Skylar and them. But come on, bro. We got a little daughter. Oh boy, Victor. Oh, no, it's Jesse. It is him. We got a problem. Some kind of chemical leaking in your lab. You gotta come with me. <gasps> Fuck the whole plan up. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll follow you. They tell me to bring you. I bring you. Come on, get in the car. Is he gonna kill Victor? That boy nah. pulled up on this like Bro, something leaking in the lab. They better go kill Walt now. Yeah. He got to call Jesse and tell Jesse to do it. <laughs> and it's at night. Nah, I'm cool. Yo, I'm hold cool. on. I mean, let me go do something in the crib. Okay, my stomach hurt. I'm gonna take a shit real quick. Shit, that boy walking And they sent Victor to get him. And it's gonna be down in the you lab. Nobody. Text in the back, like yo, go kill this nigga, man. Out of ran. <laughs> out of ran. That boy's driving out and just crashed the car. Ain't no way I'm getting. Once you go back there, you done. Let's see you here. They said Mike. I don't know if it's a barrel leak or what, but you got something mighty stinky down there. <laughs> His steps after you. Nah, you can go in front of me, whoa. Walter, the sooner you figure out what this is, the sooner we all go home. You like, please don't do this. Please Mike. don't do this. Mike. Yeah, unfortunately, I do, Walter. Downstairs. Okay, if I could just talk to Gus. No. I know I can make him understand. Please, no. if I could talk to Gus, I can, I can convince him. Of oh, shut up. Shut up. I can't do it. I'm sorry. He got no obligation to, to wall either. Yeah, he's trying to stop. I'll give you Jesse Pinkman. Okay? Like you said, he's the problem. And, and he's he's in town, all right? He's he's not in Virginia or wherever the hell you're looking for him. He's right here. How you know Virginia? I'll take you right to him. Yo, he wanted to give up Jesse. Where is he? Right now, you give me an address. I, I don't know. He's, he moves. He moves around. But if, if you let me call him, I... no, no, please. 
Okay. Walt willing to give up Jesse? Nah, he wasn't trying. And that's... He got to talk in code or something. He gonna say something only that... They know. Jesse knows. So I'm saying talking cold. Sky again. It's his last days. Fuck is you talking about? I'm getting fried too, boy. Roll that thing up. Pull that thing up. I'm on my toes every two seconds. I'm on my back. You're not taking no shots for getting up. fried. It's your last days on earth. Bro, bro. I mean, roll that shit right now. All that shit. <laughs> Swipe. Did you do it? Oh my god. I can't now. It's gonna have to be you. No way, man. Listen to me. You're closer than we are. You'll have about a 20 minute lead. They've got me at the laundry and they're going to kill me. Jesse, do it now! Do it, bitch! Do it, do it fast! Do it, Jesse! Do it! Jesse, what the hell was that? You might want to hold off. Why? Because your boss is gonna need me. 6353 Juan Tabo, apartment six. Yeah. Yo, Mike, like, yo, this motherfucker crazy. I never met a motherfucker this crazy. Yo. I don't think Jesse, I, think, I don't think Wizenberg. I rock with Walt. Yeah, I don't walk with my man. You stupid. He said, one more cook. You ain't getting that cook. What about? And now I need my assistant back. What about? Okay. Only person know how to shake that like me. Pause. Shoot it. How can I help you? That's another shit on Jesse's conscience. He can't do it. Take whatever you want. Cause I Gail's so innocent, man. I got, I got a lot of money. Where that money at though? Um. This is so fucked. Please, don't do this. He is a killer at this point when he do this. Don't have to do this. This is everything that he was saying to Walt. It's fucked up. Don't put me in front of that shit. He did it. Thought he wasn't gonna do it. Stupid. He's with a shot at Misty. <laughs> He's gonna tell him to just pack his stuff and leave and never, and never come back. Bro, man, I gotta see a body to make sure he did, bro. I gotta see a body to make sure I gotta keep water around. Stupid. Did you see that body with that bullet in the head? Man, I ain't got no choice but to keep this boy water around. Yeah, that was the end of season three. Bro, going into this next season, it's about to get crazy. Now Walt holding something over Gus' head. Gus holding something over Walt's head. Jesse's still out here trying to, you mean? I'm telling you right now, man. Jesse did not kill Gail, bro. That was a fact. They would have showed us. They just now showed this last episode Walt running down on. Tongue. Hit boy with the car. Bro, mm. it's the end of the season. It's supposed mm. to leave that mysterious. Mm. Run, but Jesse he didn't cried. kill him, bro. Jesse don't got it any. He don't got it any, bro. He had multiple times to kill multiple people, and he did not have it in him, bro. Okay. The ATM John. He, he went Tuko. there, bullshit it the whole Tuko. time. Didn't kill him. He shot Tuco. He shot Tuco, right? No. Yes, he did. Walt shot Tuco. Oh, he did. Yes, he did. He kicked he the gun over to Walt, and Walt shot him in the jaw. He did. Yes, he did. Yeah. Jesse, hey Siri, who shot Tuco, Walt or Jesse? Y'all refresh us on that, man. But I believe Walt shot that man. But the only thing Jesse did has done is the thing with the body. I'm I'm pretty sure. Jesse just don't got it in him, man. So for my prediction, I believe he's just gonna tell Gail to pack up and just leave and never come back. And if he does, this is gonna happen. But love season three season three has been the littest that we've watched so far so much had so much happened jesse shoddy bro bro jesse shoddy like come on bro my memory really like that got that shit you know okay like come on bro he and he, he go to die from that bro he could have could have could have he went to the hospital he can't go to the hospital jesse don't got it any bro that's that that's, that's Jesse's body right there. Where are we? Right. So no, actually it's Hanks. But hey, let's Jesse. go. What happened at the beginning of this season? We we started off with Walt with the plane crashing. Skylar being a weirdo. She's still a weirdo. Ted being a creep. 
Boy, and he ain't and no Jesse, creepy. Yes, he player. is. He a player. Boy, and Jesse getting thrown into so many things. Jesse dealing with the death of uh, Jane at the beginning. Starting to mess with Andrea. The loss of her brother. So, like, he's been through a lot since season two, since season one, for real. So, you know, I do have a soft spot for Jesse, but he's getting to the point to where he's a liability, man. Going forward, I guess he's just going to have to duck and hide until they get rid of Gus, I guess, because there's no there's no other way that, you know, Jesse can show face around anywhere. Walt now is playing into that full role of Heisen. With season two, they talked about like they needed to have that, that presence behind them so people didn't cross them and that's what they lacked. And now it's like Walt is being that person. At first he was trying to push Jesse to do all the dirty work. Now Walt is putting it all on himself and doing it his way. And if it ends up with somebody dying, a justifiable reason for him and he's willing to do that job, man. So going forward, I think or Walt, he's full highs in now, man. My boy's fully in it. And I definitely think this is going to take a toll on him to where he might start pushing himself back from his family because he knows he's not the same man and he's not going to be able to sugarcoat it or hide face anymore. Boy, I forgot so much that happened this season. Ooh, that should have been... Gotta like go through everything. Or two. Looking at it, he already says the stuff that happened in the beginning with the whole plane crash and... Skylar acting weird. We got a Ted Benicky. She started moving in, like, start moving. She was going to start moving stuff into his career, but then she kicked, Walt got kicked out this John. The whole John when Hank was on Jesse's ass when it was in the, the, the John. Then uh, he called and said Marie got in a car accident. So then he left and they crushed the shit. Then Hank was done after that finish. Then he went to his crib, punched on him. Jesse hurt him. Ah, my body, my back, my neck. Ah, ah. Then he was going to uh, press charges on him. Took my boy's badge, the twins came, cause he ain't have his gun in his bag. They say he ain't nothing but it. Uh -uh, uh -uh. The twins, but, uh, walk the twins up. walked up on him. Then na 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 na. That boy Hank survived that job. Hank in the hospital. Still, Skyler basically telling Marie a falsified story um, about him. You know what I mean? Making his money through gambling and counting cards. Them kind of getting back. To, I don't really know what's going on with their whole situation. But We're in business oh, together. you got think too when um my man Mike went to his crib and bugged his crib. That was all this season, bro. That's a lot that happened this season when he bugged Walt's crib. Was that season two? I think that was end of season two, and he took it out at the end, like right at the yeah, end of season bugging. two. Yeah, now nah, it's just all kind of no, go together. Cause that's when the twins came. No, that was this season because the twins came and he knew that they came because of the bug in the crib. That's when they came to his crib with the axe and shit. And they walked in his crib, sat down when he was in the shower. Yeah, that might have... That was this season. It was this season because Skylar started fucking with Ted, Ted this, this season. season. It was this season. Um, my boy Flynn, you know what I'm saying? Boy going out, get his drive, his, his uh, pro, what is it, provisionary drone that he was mm -hmm. talking about. A lot happened this season. Whole Wendy shit happened this season too when he uh, was going to have Wendy Ooh. kill him. Um, and then us ended it off these last two episodes. They had, that little, they had that little setback episode. The Probably the weakest episode we watched so far, episode it's 10, fly. was the fly shit. And then they ramped it up the last three, like, got me. Yo, imagine sitting here and having to wait, though. But that just showed yeah, how wait. unstable Walt was, I guess. It was just showing, like... What, this? Like, that was the last bit of Walt. This? The fly. The, the fly episode. Because he was I so was on tweaking. edge. He was tweaking, man. Everybody got their tweaking days. And I said Hank went home too, so Hank yeah. was heading back home. Nah, that whole scene with Marie was funny as shit. <laughs> Boy, funny as shit. But um, yeah, man, it's gonna be crazy going into season four. I can't imagine having to sit and wait how many ever years it was in between this and right, season four. Excited to have this ended off, man. It was a lot that happened. We just went over it, but feelings towards this whole thing. I respect that boy Walt. Like I said, I'm Swizenberg, man. I'm standing behind that boy Walt. Um, there's a lot of things that in his shoes I would have done differently, but then again, I in his shoes for me, so you can't really say that to you in his shoes. The whole Milio shit, they gotta go. You know what I'm saying? The crazy eight, whatever man's name was, I would have got yeah, rid of them early. Eight. You know what I mean? But that was just like the downfall. Everything after that was like, 
They operate the saw of this, but shit. What you mean, bro? They fresh in the street selling that new shit. You feel me? That blue shit. You feel well, me? for what? Sell that new shit. That blue shit. I can't make. I can't. You know, blame Walt for all his Man, mistakes. Listen, but Jesse been in the business for a while. No, and just shaky, baby. a lot of the shit that the position they was in because Walt was getting greedy, bro. The whole shit with Skinny. the combo. The whole shit with Skinny. combo was Walt trying. You know what I'm saying? Push the boundaries and shit. Like I said, man, he fresh in the game. He's just figuring shit out. You're going to make the mistakes, but his mistakes is in the... You know what I'm saying? How many me? bodies that um, But if you would claim as a chain reaction, all the bodies he got oh, was the whole bro. plane shit. You can't say that, bro. But like, yes, you can, bro. You can, but like, bullshit and went back to yeah, work. Yeah, that's a fact, but that's a chain react for me. The kids react. Oh, man, it's going to be interesting. Like he said, that boy Gail up out of there. That boy Jesse shotting, bro. Boy, mm, he was crying. He's shotting, bro. He was crying, bro. If he was just it sitting there looking matter. at him, he'd have been cool. That boy was crying, bro. That was Jesse versus Jessenberg. He didn't do it. Yeah. Bro, he's chatting. You think, bro, how they going to survive this whole situation, bro? He said he got to be the only Bro, girl. Jesse, I'm telling you, bro. Bro, Jesse hit the Jesse, pipe before that. He put that shit in the system. He put the Percocet in the system. He, he did that. Up. He put that perk in the system. He did that it. before he was gonna go out and shoot those two people and but walk up to him. The little kid was there. The little kid was there. There was no little kid there. I'm talking about with the ATM, the whole ATM. Bro, I'm not talking about that. He was gonna. And it don't them. matter. He was gonna blink them. No, he, <laughs> he was gonna blink no, them. No, he wasn't. Yo, he walked. Out comment, he walked. Put a one if Jesse was gonna blink <laughs> no. them. No, <laughs> put a two. He would have got was... shot and died, bro. Never. That boy Jesse was hit one of them. Well, no, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. He's about to get his. He's about to get split in half, bro. That's how they be he walked movie. up. He walked up with his hands in his hoodie. <laughs> He's about to blink him. Yeah, right. They was about to the blow. Blinky. They was about to blow that boy to the moon. Oh, that just, uh... But yeah, man, this joint was tough. Excited to see where season four go. I ain't gonna say I'm a believer. Doubters turn believers. I just have to going, stay tuned until all the way to end. If, see, if halfway through season four, it's really like that. Nah. They got that. Nah, I got to watch the whole thing through oh. because they said the reason that that Breaking Bad was better than Game of Thrones was because every season got better. And I'm hearing through the grapevine that the last season wasn't all that. So y'all can't be saying. Breaking Bad? That's a, some people, right, people are saying the last, people are saying the last season was the worst season. She won, she won, she won, she won. We appreciate y'all, man. If you enjoyed the reaction, make sure you like the video, comment down below, let us know your thoughts, on the subscribe button, the bell, comment so you're notified. <laughs> no cats with that, with the smoke. On the yeah. <laughs> I had to really put Yo, them in the Jesse not real. built like me. I would have ran in there. Bro. <laughs> I ran in there. You to open the door out of the me. Yeah, because he, no he started talking, and yeah, that's yeah, when he started, like, please don't. Like, please, like please, that's how I was. Like please out. Hold on. I would have heard yeah, the, the door oh. opening and let off like five. Nah, I'm, 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 as soon as I heard I the door, I don't care who behind there is. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang a little sister open the door. I'm still <laughs> nah, he did have to make sure it was him. As soon as I would have seen mean? it with him, bro, he gave me the Addy. If it's somebody, if it's the wrong Addy, my fault. <laughs> <Nah>. <laughs> my fault. What yo, you it's me or them, and you know, them boys is on the way. Like, come on, she that's what crazy. you mean. He knew he's seen him walk in, so there's nowhere, there's no way it's the wrong Addy. No, bro, I'm just saying, no, bro, I'm if saying, it's the wrong though, person that opened the door, I like, oh, well, you, you the... in that crib, wrong place, wrong time. Checking the corner, I'm not even hitting the SWAT team. You don't know what's behind there, who's in there, running through there, Random. running through the crib but like this. You know that they only do it, though. I can't waste no time. I'm knocking. As soon as I hear feet creep up, I'll clear that room like a clip out that. I would clear that room like a Call of Duty mission. Yeah, shit, cat them price on that drum. But nah, man. Um, head over to the head over to the Patreon. Like you said, man, we watch about two to three episodes a week on Patreon. So uh, <laughs> we'll be. <laughs> Watch this smoke go out the gun after you kill Yeah, I really Mike. did that. I really did that. But nah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that's insane. If you do that, nah, he's crazy. you got some screws. I'm going to add both the Patreon and YouTube to this. But Patreon, we appreciate y'all too, man. Thank y'all for all love and support. Like I said, we're going to have Eric, we're going to have the Patreon side about um, a season ahead. We're watching two to three episodes a go week. Over there. And um, they just finished season three. Y'all just got season three, episode one on YouTube by the time we finish this. So 
Listen, man, if you want to go, basically, we're going to be almost, we're going to be basically on season five when y'all get season basically, four. Basically, yeah. Me, so. You might be further. Appreciate than y'all. Man. When y'all get this, we're going to be on season five. five you yeah. me? For a shit show. But until the next video, for both Patreon and YouTube, man. The kids reacted.